Hey, today I'm at Printed Threads with Brett Bowden. Hey, that's me. Yeah. I've always thought Brett was rather interesting. I mean, had an interesting culture. So we're gonna go check it out. The culture of a screen printing shop here at Printed Threads. Uh, I think we're fun, energetic, you know, a little bit punk rock. Um, but at the end of the day, it's kind of a big group of people that, that likes to have fun together. And so those days that are really hard days and we have to work extra hours and all that stuff, it usually ends with everybody just kind of hanging out, uh, which is super fun. Like we'll work till eight o'clock at night and then we'll all go to dinner together, which is it's a pretty rad thing when you can work with people that you actually enjoy being around. We certainly get customers that come to us based on our culture uh, because maybe they aren't our culture but they like the creativity that comes with it and so we can add our spice to whatever they're doing um, but then on the other side we um, probably attract people that are the same as us It's nice to work with creatives. I mean, you can you can find a t-shirt company that I'm sure would just, you know, make a t-shirt comic sans font on it and say it's awesome for you. But when you have people that are like involved in music or they're in either bands or involved in bands, they kind of know the market we're trying to hit. So it makes it easier, I guess. To answer your question, yeah, it, it does. I never thought about it, but it does influence us because they are more in touch with our market, so it makes it easier for us. What do you guys think, so Alex, what do you think it, it is, uh, feels like to come to work every day? What does it feel like? It feels good, because you're around people that you like to work with, so. Yeah? Yeah. Feels good? Yeah. And it's a challenge, too, every day. We get, we're so busy right now, so. It's just like teamwork. Yeah? Pulling together, making the dream work. <laughs> teamwork makes the dream work. I think with great leadership also comes trust uh, and empowerment. And so we really need to empower the leaders that we've put in place uh, to do a great job and to trust them so that they can kind of take ownership in what they do. If we're there 100% of the time and we're just micromanaging, then they're gonna feel like probably bummed out and, uh, and not take ownership of the company the same way they would if you let them spread their wings on their own. Blackbirds singing in the dead of night Take these arc rings and learn to fight oh, That's it, that's all you get. <laughs> Sweet! It's the only song I know. Quite all the time.